Welcome to Picture Healer channel. Today we are going to look at the energy for 2024 based on the Zi Wei Dou Shu, the four transformation stars. The energy of these four stars will greatly impact the energy of the whole year. The four transformation can also be considered as four categories. In Chinese, they are called the Lu Quan Ke Ji. The first category, the Lu, is about prosperity, about money, what is abundant for you this year. The second category is about the Quan, or the power, what you have control over, what you like to achieve, and uh, what you are working on. The third category is called the Ke, or the fame and status, and it's more about stable energy and helpful people. The last category is called the Ji, or the problem area, the areas we are struggling, and the areas you care a lot but difficult to sort it out. And every year there are four different stars in these four categories, and this is based on the 10 heavenly stems. 2024 is the year of Jia Chen. Jia is a heavenly stem. So based on that, we have these four particular stars. So let's start with the first one. So the first one is the area of abundance and prosperity. It's related to a star called the Lian Zhen. The Lian Zhen star can be called the upright star or the chastity star. This one is not really a very positive star. It can be a mixed star. Since we are talking about the Lu, the prosperity and abundance, so this is not a bad influence. This star can mean very self-centered, always try to win and try to argue, and sometimes like to gamble. This star is also related to romance, and this star like to change a lot and can become double-faced or even multiple personality. So we have the Lian Zhen star in the abundance category. That means we will see a lot of this type of personality. People might not trust each other, like to change a lot, and tend to gamble or indulge in social life. And we might focus more on appearance and become more arrogant or self-centered. This star can be related to more non-traditional way of making money. And you'll see more of that the conventional way is getting outdated. And because we have the Taiyang star in the trouble category, the traditional way of doing business or career is becoming less and less popular. So anything new, even it's more adventurous or even kind of gambling, might become more fruitful in 2024. And the second category is about the power and the control. In this category, we have the star called the Po Jun. The Po is breaking and the Jun is military. So literally, this star means breaking the old and starting new with the military force. In 2023, we also have this star in the Lu category. So that's the first category of abundance. And we see a lot of this kind of character breaking the old rules and start something new. In 2024, we have this poor Jun star in the power category. So we will see a lot of these characters. It's like the personality of a military leader. He might have a strong willpower and more straightforward emotion. And he's not afraid to take risk and go on adventure. With this star, you will see a lot of interesting ideas, a lot of new ideas, and a non-traditional one. And people are not afraid to make changes. It's the energy of revolution. 
it's good to make changes. That can mean breaking down the old ways and building up something new. And this start is also related to politics and the leadership. So if you want to have power, you might want to adopt the new way. And not afraid to criticize the old way of doing things and change the direction and just go for it. So that's the energy about power and control in 2024. The third category is about fame and reputation and the help for people. And in 2024, we have the Wu Qi star. This is one of the very lucky stars usually related to finance. The Chinese character Wu can mean military or physical type of energy. And the Wu Qi is a very strong force. It's a little bit similar to the Po Jin. It's very powerful. It's very direct, very decisive, and kind of serious. And the Wu Qi star is usually related to starting your own business, starting from zero, but you are not afraid to go for your dreams. And in 2024, this type of energy is favored and lucky. So the opportunity and helpful people will come when you are being decisive, hardworking, and focus on your long-term goals. This Wu Qi star sometimes can become too serious and uh, cold, and even antisocial. But the Wu Qi star shows a lot of strength and the power on his or her own career and profession, and that's how you gain fame and status in 2024. The last category is the trouble area. And in 2024, it's in the Taiyang star, the sun. And it's related to yang energy and the fire energy. And it's usually related to male, the leader, or the senior. And since this star is in the trouble category, the Taiyang's traditional characteristics can be challenged in 2024. The traditional way of doing business, career, and leadership can become very unstable. We might want to re-examine the old ways. And this star is also related to politics, kind of like the poor Jin star. But this star represents the old way of doing things, the authority and the old power. And it can be questioned a lot this year. It can show more conflict because of different ideas and um, become more chaotic overall in 2024. And this troubled category is also the lesson we have to learn during this year. It gives us problems and challenges, and we have to come up with ways to deal with it. And since we are in a big change overall since the COVID time, and also we are in the transition to the period 9 feng shui. There's a lot of unstable energy and we do have to honor that and make adjustment, change what's not working and try different things to see which one works the best. So that's the four transforming stars in 2024. You can look at it in the big picture look at the international affairs, look at the politics, and also on personal level, we all affected by those four different categories and different star energy. I hope you find this video useful. Thank you so much for watching and see you next time.